Hi everyone, my name is Kevin. Today I wanna to show you how you can edit a PDF using Microsoft Word. And as full disclosure, before we jump into this, I work at Microsoft as a full-time employee. All right, well let's jump on the desktop. Here I am on my desktop and I have a PDF file called Certificate. I'm gonna go ahead and click on that and I have this nice certificate that I found online. It's a PDF file and I run a company and I have some employees who I wanna celebrate. You know, instead of giving people a pay raise, I'm just gonna give them this paper certificate and hopefully that makes them satisfied with this company. No, really, I'd probably just give them more money. I think that makes people happy. Um, and maybe throw the certificate in too. Um, but here's the certificate, and unfortunately, it's a PDF, and I can't edit the name of the recipient. I can't type anything down here. I can't type in a date. It's kind of annoying how it's hard to edit PDFs. So I wish I could just open it and just start typing. But luckily, it's pretty easy to do if you have Microsoft Word. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and let's close this certificate for now. And I'm gonna open up Microsoft Word. Now, this is the latest version of Word. This comes with Office 365. But if you have an older version as well, this should probably work. I can't guarantee it. I just know that it works with the most recent, uh, recent copy of Word. So I'm on the Word home screen here, and it's actually very simple to open this PDF. So I'm gonna click on the certificate, and I could just drag that over to Word. As an alternative, I could also go to Open, and I could find where the file is on my PC, but I'm gonna go with the easy approach. We're simply gonna drag and drop the certificate over. Now I get this long message here, and I know it's very easy to just always click OK when you see a message, but basically all it's telling me that it's gonna do is it's gonna take that PDF and it's gonna convert that into a Word document. Um, and it'll be optimized for me to edit. Ooh, edit's what I wanna do, that sounds good. And it might not look exactly like the original PDF, especially if the original PDF contained a lot of graphics. Okay, sounds reasonable, let's give it a shot. So I'm gonna click on OK, and I could also set it so it never shows me that message again. So we're gonna click on OK, and let's see here. Um, so here's the certificate I just showed you as a PDF, and the nice thing now is, look at that, I could just type letters on this PDF, I can modify it. So, let's say for my company, the first winner of the employee of the month is Kevin Stratford. No better person to win than the owner of the company. Um, now I'm sure that's gonna improve morale of all of my employees. Uh, so I'm just gonna make sure that's nice and centered. So there it is, awarded to Kevin Stratford. And unfortunately I can't click right down here. So why don't I just copy this text box. And so that way I get that same font. And I'm just gonna get rid of the underline. We're gonna reduce the font size a little bit. Ooh, name of presenter. That's a little awkward because I'm the owner and I'm also the presenter and I gave it to myself. That's really obvious now, but um, we'll just go with it. And then for the date, we're gonna put in September 1st. So we're just gonna enter in today's date, September 1st, 2019. And there we have it. So I modified or I edited this certificate and now what I could do is I could go to file and we're gonna go to save as and now what I could do is I could actually save it as a PDF. So maybe I'm gonna call this a certificate Kevin since it's gonna be my certificate. We'll go ahead and click on save. And so now what this has done is it saved a new PDF and I modified it. So here, you know, it's awarded to me, presented by me and uh, it has today's date on it. Uh, so that's how you um, open a PDF using Microsoft Word, how you could edit the PDF using Microsoft Word, and then how you could save your uh, save it as a PDF again using Microsoft Word. Um, so you could open, edit, and save and get it back into a PDF format. Um, it's actually really easy to do if you have Word. Um, so yeah, go ahead, go ahead, edit those PDFs. Hopefully this helped you. If it did, please give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more videos like this in the future, other tutorial videos or how to, hit that subscribe button. That way you get a notification anytime new content comes out. And lastly, if there's anything else you wanna learn about, anything else that you're dying to figure out how to do, leave a comment down below and I'll add it to my list of videos to create in the future. And hey, that's all I had for you today. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Bye.